Hi. Nearly every day in the morning, Yumi is always facing her wardrobe, staring on her collection of clothes, and then ask me, What should I wear, girls? And because of the way it's organized on the wardrobe, it's very hard for me to visualize how it will look when she wears the outfit. One day he just told me, You know what? I can make an app for you. I know that I'm good at technology. Let me use what I'm good at to build something that can actually help her. It's very interesting to live in with him. Um, because he's such a creative soul. <laughs> it's good to hear that. <laughs> <laughs> I live with Yumi and, and Dexter, our two years and three months old son. And also three of our parents live with us at the moment. My parents came from Indonesia and Yumi's parents came from China. And they got stuck here because of the coronavirus, but it's actually working quite well. FACE stands for a Fashion AI. As the name implies, it is an AI technology which can help you, me, to make decision of what outfit to wear today. It's a difficult question. I'm studying fashion and textile merchandising. That's why I have my standard of the clothes I have to wear every day. <laughs> if you want to recommend somebody an outfit to wear, you need to know uh, what clothes that you like the most, right? And what clothes you wear on certain weather conditions, right? And you also want to give a recommendation based on the variety, not clothes that you wear already yesterday and the days before. So in order to do this, you would need to actually be able to see what has been she wearing. So the process of making Fei starts with uh, AWS Deep Lens. It's a camera with a built-in computer inside that can run AI technology. I built the object detection model using Amazon SageMaker. When the AI detected the presence of the body and face, the photo will be cropped and will be sent directly to the cloud, which identify the face of the person. If the face is Yumi, the photo will be recorded in the fashion diary, together with the current temperature and the weather condition today. The plan is to put the deep lens on top of this cabinet, and it's going to face towards the front door. This is the door Yumi need to go through in order to meet her friends or to go to work. Once I have the AWS deep lens installed and enabled, my next job is to calibrate the viewing angle. And to test whether it's really working, I'm going to walk towards the front door and stand there and to see if I can see this blue and orange box. Woohoo! Awesome! It's working! Isn't that the most beautiful blue and orange box? So the technology is working well when you test it. However, when I run the system for a couple hours, thousands of images of my mother-in-law actually being recorded there. This is my mother-in-law, Xiao. This is the best dumpling in the world in the making. It's super crunchy on the outside and just melt right inside your mouth. The place that she makes the dumpling is the kitchen bench just right next to the front door. And it's in the view of where the deep lens is. So I just simply set up a, a bounding box zone. I call it a mother-in-law detection zone. So I got rid of my mother-in-law. Not physically, but <laughs> digitally just to clarify, right? <laughs> the long-term plan for this project is there will be a system that identify the unique clothes. So if I open the app, there's a date, then there's a weather on that day. And once I have this clothes catalog, okay, the next plan is to combine it with the fashion diary data. What item in the catalog that she wore on certain days and what weather condition to be able to build a recommendation system. My hope is one day she can even ask Faye, hey Faye, recommend me a clothes to wear today. And Faye will just show the photo. They make my life much easier. I can ask Goose's opinion at night time. Goose, does it look good? Does this one look good, right? So the conversation is still there, right? But I have a visual reference. This is better. This is better. And um, actually I have a good taste. I have to say. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm improving. Yes. <laughs> <laughs>